Hello YouTube, it's my week up back and as you can tell by the title, this is a tutorial on how to add enchantments to your sword, pickaxe or any other tool. And as you could see earlier, I am doing this on a sword with two enchantments already. Okay, so let's get started. Just load up Horizon, Minecraft, um, and also um, as you can see I was on a new world. Um, in that previous little gameplay bit and yep that's my new survival world and I've decided that's the world that I'm just going to do all the Minecraft modding tutorials on because I can't be asked to do another world but yep just find your save go to content save game dot dot and extract it to the desktop And yep, I've decided to put Minecraft on in the background for some Minecraft tunage. But yeah. Alright, so now it's close horizon. And you'll need these two folders. Uh, as you, if you've seen the other the episode before this, you would already know. But as always, they'll be in the description. Just load up the Minecraft Save Editor Extractor, sorry. And drag in your save game. Right, now we'll just hold the save game and hover over extract save data and drop it ok after it's done what it needs to do you'll get the save game folder and now what we're going to do is load up the nbt folder and load up nbt ok just drag the save game folder onto nbt and then we can maximize this and ok so now you're going to want to find your player I am this player as what in, in the inventory there's only one item and that's my sword. Okay, so what you're gonna wanna do now excuse me is type in on Google enchantment list IDs summer summer along those lines and then just load up the Minecraft wiki. What it'll do is it'll show you, it'll, well, it'll tell you the IDs for each enchantment so you know what you're going to be adding. So to scroll down to whatever tool you're going to be enchanting, mine's going to be the sword and I'm going to add every single one. Alright. Just going to close that. So, how many enchantments are there for the sword? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so there's seven enchantments for the sword. So go back onto NBT. Um, here you can see we have the sword here. And go onto the tag enchantment two entries. These are the two enchantments. So what you're going to want to do is to add more. Click on the enchantment with uh, the entries in, and click add compound tag. I'm going to add five more because then I'll have seven. And this is for each enchantment. Okay, so. The enchantments I've got is ID 17 and ID 20. But what you're going to want to do to get these little tags here is click on the uh, compound tag, then go up to the top here and click on short tag, and then name the first one ID exactly how I do, then the second one LVL for level. Do this for all compound tags. Oops. 
I'm going to minimize them so they don't go off the screen. Okay, just bear with me while I do this. Nearly done now. One more tag to go. Okay. Let's go back on here. The first enchantment is sharpness, and the max level is 5. So um, the ID is 16, so for ID type in 16 and the level type in 5. Just checking that we haven't already got that. Nope. So type in, double click on there, then you type in 16, then double click on the level and type in 5. And as you can see here we've already got 17, so let's move straight on to 18, which is Bernadath Report, and you can get that level 5. So let's go back to NBT. ID 18, level 5. And I'm going to just make my smite level 5 up from level 4 so that that is the max level. Okay, so next I think it's level 19 because we don't have that. Yep, knocked back, and that's 2. So ID 19, level 2. ID 19, oh crap, level 2, and we've got ID 20, so now, just 21, and 34, and they are both level 3, so okay, done with this webpage now. Uh, I think it was 21, I forgot. Crap, I have such bad memory. Yep, 21 and 34. Yeah, 21 34. Sorry about that, I just forgot. I'm a noob. 21 34. Oh, flip it out. Hit this keyboard. Level 3. Level 3. There we go, we now have all sword enchantments on our sword. And what I'm just going to do is change the count to four, so I can have four of these swords for ready for when one breaks. Okay, so now we just minimize that, click save, close NBT. Don't need this web page anymore, so we can close that. And now you want to get your save game dot dat and drag it over, create save game dot dat and drop it. And then you should see here, it should make a save game output folder. Now what we're going to want to do is just wait for it to finish what it's doing. Then go to Horizon. Click on the save game. And replace. And then up here you want to search desktop, just type in save game balls. Save, flip it out. Save game output right there let's locate the folder and replace it with your new save game let's wait for it to come up saying it's done it and then really important make sure you save rehash and resign otherwise all we've just done will not count it will not be saved let's wait for it the computer's been slow as usual and there we go. Now we can just close that, close that, close that, and we are done. So I'll see you back at the Xbox to see this awesome sword.
Thank you.